In Melbourne, we've started autumn with grey skies and wet weather. Jane Bunn joins us now. Jane, will the warmer weather return? Mitch, this is just a brief bit of cool. Warm sunshine returns tomorrow. We had drizzly showers passing through this morning. Drops of drizzle, they struggle to add up to much, but a few spots saw five millimetres. Now, this activity only let it rise to 17 degrees by 11am. It eventually reached 20.5 as the cloud broke up. Now this is 10 degrees cooler than what we saw yesterday and cooler than what we average in March. Days are around 24, nights 13. But it doesn't necessarily mean the end of hot weather. It has reached 41.7 in March before, back in 1940. And we average five days of 30 or higher and one day of 35 or more. Last year's hottest March day was 33. It has been as cold as 2.8 in the city, but I wouldn't expect that anymore. We could still have sweltering evenings. A recent March night didn't fall below 26. We average 50 millimetres of rain, but it has been as high as 191. The driest year was just 3.7, so not far from what we saw in February this year. We are in a fairly dry pattern, and the outlook for autumn as a whole is trending on the dry side. Now, It'll depend on what lows actually move through. But we may lack moisture to feed them. And there is another stretch of sunshine on the way. We've got a high moving in. I'll have more soon, Mitch.